first I'm going to talk to you about me as a writer, then you can ask any questions, and then we're going to look at you as a writer. You're going to write a story with my help. So some of you will be thinking, yay! Some of you are thinking, hmm. Some of you are thinking, meh. So we'll sort you out. So a lot of local people don't realise what services the library can offer to the children of Odeby. And this is a new library, it's absolutely fantastic with the coffee facilities, um, computer facilities and um, all the extra activities that go on at weekends and school holidays to involve the children. The most important thing is all the services are free, the use of the internet's free, people can do everything from job searching to information finding. Some of the children were saying, I don't have money with me to buy a book today and we were saying it really does not matter because you can come and no, borrow the book no, right. and if you've not finished reading it, you can come back, re-borrow the book and it's all free. And maybe some people in the community aren't quite aware that all the services are free. No, no. And the location of this new library is much better than where it was before. It was stuck away on a car park. This is on the high street. People walk by it. Every time I walk by, there's always people sitting here just even reading the newspapers. You don't actually have to come in just for the books. It's customer focused. It's about people. That's the staff as well as the people who come in here. If you're a little bit hesitant, as you get to the door, there's a list of what's on offer in here. You feel, oh, okay, yeah, I can get the free broadband. I'll go in and ask. You can access information. You can go and talk to the council, who can sometimes also be a bit remote. I quite like you to be born with a default library membership. <laughs> <laughs>